Um, Dan, we go in there on Monday night. I think we have to win. I, I, I think it is up to stage. I think it was on to there. City will probably win at the weekend. If we don't win, we could be, what, six, seven points behind them. You know, <clears throat> I know it's I know it's early days, but with the level that these two clubs are at over the last couple of years, Dan, a lot of them are must wins. They just are. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree, Gav. I, 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 the, the season is, um, is is so unique in so many ways because of the mid-season break, the World Cup. Then you've got everybody maybe having, if they go far in the World Cup, a week or two weeks off and then coming back. And then you've probably got the, the conundrum of clubs saying... Do we sell? Do we send these players off for a couple of weeks holiday, and do we just you know make do for a couple of weeks to try and just rest their legs? So even if you're giving City six seven point head start, you you don't really want to be doing that in that in 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 a season like this because you come in, you you got the first sixteen odd games in the league, and you got the World Cup post World Cup. Then it's got to be a case of if you are playing catch up. It's got to be a near perfect second half of the season and post World Cup. I don't really see how our squad can do that. Not not near perfect, especially when City, when you put them up against us in terms of numbers and durability of players. The, the, you know they they trump us, but this game on Monday for the best part of twenty odd years, I've hated playing Man United home or away. Hated it. I'm the same as most people in the chat or most people on the panel. Can't stand United, hate them. And playing them every single season, home or away, whether we are dominant or not, has always been a game of dread for me. Because um, they'll be up for it, no doubt, on Monday night. They'll be up for it, but they are an absolute mess. Um, I've watched bits of the, the Brighton game and I've watched bits of the Brentford game the weekend. They are absolute mess they're sham they're shambles at the back he's asking them to obviously to play out from the back and be progressive through the lines and they've not got players that are comfortable on the ball not doing that